So, uh, we're not finished. Uh, Bayonetta. My queen. My everything. A character that I've fallen in love with almost immediately. Yes, this game. There's a secret boss. And we're gonna live react to it here and now. Apparently the requirements are quite high in order to unlock this boss. And to be quite honest, I don't got the time for that. And I want to play Bayonetta 2. And I know a lot of you want to see that too. So make sure you leave a like to show your support and subscribe with notifications turned on because if you don't, you'll miss out on Bayonetta 2, which is gonna be happening very soon. Anyway, let's go check this out. Apparently there's a secret boss to fight in this game that I know nothing about, and I'm gonna live react to it. I'm not even gonna look at the title. I'm not even gonna look at it. I'm gonna click into it and play it. With <gasps> oh yes, they're wearing the outfit. This is perfect. They're wearing the Link outfit. All right, okay, so the secret boss is... Whoa. Wait, wait, the secret boss is Rodan. Why is he golden and... Why is he wearing a dress? The infinite one, Father Roden. Okay, so we're gonna see like, like a pro player take on Radan. And they have a serious amount of health bars, which is really, really impressive. Okay, so this this is the secret boss fight. This is actually kind of insane. Okay. Now, what I've actually figured out as well from playing this game on the Switch, that when you unlock the sword or the katana, it actually works as the master sword if you're wearing the Link outfit. But they look like whoever's playing this has got some serious upgrades on their sword. And this fight looks crazy. But well, they're doing pretty well, it seems, I think. I love how whoever's game this is has like 7.2 million rings. Oh no! You're almost out of health. I take it keeping your distance from Rodan is... The best solution to victory here. They almost got it. They almost got this. They almost got it won. This is exactly how it would have played out if I played it. Now, if I fought this secret boss, this is exactly how it would have played out. Easy peasy, lemons to squeezy. Oh, oh! You you use a, a lollipop. Done. Easy. Lost loads of health, though. Is there, like, a secret cutscene after beating him? I gotta hand it to you. You sure let me have my fun. I never thought a girl would beat my ass so hard. But I gotta admit, I kinda like it. This time, baby. All right. Okay. So that's 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 it. That that's cool. I mean, that's that is cool that he can fight Rodan. Um, I quite like that. I think that's I think that's pretty special. All right. So it seems that's that's it to the secret boss fight. Uh, I'm kind of glad I didn't go ahead and try grind for all of the halos to to actually unlock this secret boss fight because it looks like it's cool. And it's it's a great added 
extra in the game that you can kind of work towards but there doesn't seem to be much of a reward afterwards i think i would have liked if there was a really awesome cutscene at the end like there has been with other bosses that we fought throughout the game but it seems like it's just you you pay for this fight and you fight rodan in his weird fallen angel form i don't know what that is but they call him father rodan um i'm assuming he's like a fallen angel because they introduced him like the angels so that's kind of awesome and it does does add a little bit of lore to that character which is cool and that's that's great that's awesome fantastic more more lore for a character that they've introduced quite heavily in this game so i'm all excited about that but the one thing that i'm excited about most that i know a lot of you are excited about and that's bayonetta 2 which we're going to be starting very soon here on the channel so i can't stress this enough all right if you're not subscribed to the channel then you need to subscribe to the channel because we're going to be doing a road to bayonetta 3 yes we're so close to bayonetta 3 i can taste her it the game i can taste the release of the game it's almost here so if you want to be a part of the journey as i play through bayonetta 2 that will get you hyped and excited and prepared for bayonetta 3 then subscribe to the channel leave a like on this video for the algorithm and comment down below why you're excited for bayonetta 2 oh my god and there's going to be giveaways just like in the first let's play there's going to be giveaways in this one too so if you want to win a copy of bayonetta 3 then you know <laughs> What are you waiting for? Anyway, that's going to be it for today's video, lads. I know it's a short one, but I wanted to react to this. I hope you guys enjoy it. If you did, leave a like, subscribe to the channel if you're brand new, and comment but down below whatever you want because it's for the algorithm and it helps the channel. It gives it views, and views means money, and I need to pay for my food this week or else I will starve and die from the lack of food. So feed me, please. Anyway, that's going to be it. Thank you so much for watching. And as always, stay geeky, stay cool, be awesome, and be happy. And I'll see you dudes in my next Bayonetta video. Man, I can't wait. See you later, dudes.